Good morning, friends and family. Good, good morning. Hope you guys are doing well. I'm doing well. If you are new to the channel, then hey girl, hey, what's up? What's goody, baby? If you are an oldie, but a goody, hashtag in the comments. Not now, but right now, oldie, but a goody. Y'all, it feels so good to be back on the camera. Oh my God! Wow! It's been of quite a few days since I've actually picked up the camera to record anything. The footage that you guys saw was like some days the, what well, the footage that you guys the last video that I posted was recorded like uh some days ago um but it feels so good to be back on the camera I hope you guys are doing well y'all um so in today's video what we're doing is we're running errands I've got a lot of stuff I need to do today um we had a a, a minor scare um of the c word we thought she came to make her appearance either was the c word or the old word y'all know what i'm saying y'all know what i'm talking about we had a little scare but everybody is okay everybody is you know making cautions doing what we need to do to make sure we stay safe and sane and, and all the things and all of the things okay so i have to run out to run a lot of errands i've got a few returns i need to make i need to go get my nails done i need to go get my toes done um i just got a lot of stuff to do today okay y'all are gonna hang out with me today y'all gonna roll with lovely today you can ride with me you don't need no gas money don't touch my radio put your seatbelt on and just look pretty okay so I'm about to get dressed. I'm not even going to do my hair today, you guys. I'm like not feeling curling my hair this morning. So I might just put on a bonnet. Not a, not a bonnet. I'm going to put on my toboggan today. Yeah, because I don't really feel like curling my hair. So it's going to be one of these kind of days. I'm trying to think if I want to put on my contacts. I think I'm going to let my eyes rest from the contacts for a while. For a few days. Alright, let me put on some earrings. And let me finish getting myself together. And then we are going to... Oh, is this... Let me turn this around. And we're going to run our errands. We're going to roll out. We're going to hang out together today. Y'all going to roll with lovely. Y'all going to roll with lovely. Going to roll with lovely. Hey, hey, hey. Y'all, I feel so good. I feel so, so blessed. Um, 2022, I mean, 2021 has been a year. It's been a year, you guys. And it's been a, a one one different year it's been just a different year christmas didn't feel like christmas thanksgiving didn't feel like thanksgiving um but it's been an overall year an overall good year but you know we're gonna we're gonna walk in 2022 with positive vibes we're gonna set our intentions high we're gonna walk in the room with grace we're gonna walk in the room knowing that we are blessed we are highly favored and anything that we want in our hearts desires for the year 2022 one thing we got to do is reach up grab it first we got to put it in our mind put it in our mind act on it and let it prosper that's all we got to do, okay? But anyway, I've been rambling long enough. I think this clip has been at least about three or four minutes. But anyway, anywho, let me put my clothes on. We're going to roll out, and let's get this day started, okay? I see y'all in, in the car. In the car. Meet me in the car, okay? Meet me in the car. Hey, meet me in. I told y'all I'm feeling good today, y'all. But anyway, let me, get, let me get myself together. I'll call you back. It's easy to switch. All right, so let me show y'all really quick um, my newest addition to my shoe collection. Y'all already know I am a creature by habit, and I all anytime I wear sneakers, I'm normally wearing my black and pink Hirachis. Now I do have a pair of red Hirachis 
and I have a pair of black and white Harachis, but I use the black and white pair when I'm walking or exercising and they're kind of old so they're like just for recreational purposes like in the yard type work and the red ones I don't wear as much um and then of course the black and pink ones are the ones I kind of revert to um most of the time so my husband and my kids for Christmas bought me these uh new harachis because I don't know it's just something about the way they feel I I'm getting gas y'all make sure I don't go over but it's just something about harachis that I like I, I don't know if it's just because they're comfortable and I like the way they look on my foot I don't know what it is but I don't I, and I do have a pair of white converses and I've got a pair of Jordans or whatever but I just revert to my harachis for some reason so they got me this special edition type uh Harachis right here is yellow with this coral in the inside and they're black like that and they've got the little smiley face in the tongue part and the bottom look like that. I guess that's called the, considered the gum bottom. But yeah, they got me these for Christmas, but they are too small. Okay. He got mixed up with the sizes because y'all know men and women's sizes run a little bit different. I think he I don't know what he was thinking about when they ordered them, but these are the newest ones, but I'm going to have to take these back and see if I can either get a bigger size or get another pair. Um, but I just love Harachis. I don't know. I just literally fell in love with that's just a shoe. You know how you just get a pair of shoes and like you just kind of stick to that type of shoe, especially if you really, really like it or whatever. And I'm just a fan of Harachis. I don't know y'all. I just do. Oh, okay. And then I also need to make a return back to Belk. And I also need to go to Dick's Sporting Goods as well. Um, but let me go ahead and finish getting my gas and I'll call y'all back. Have y'all had water today? I got the Kiwi Strawberry Propel water. Um, it's zero sugar electrolytes and it's made by Gatorade. Um, so y'all know I try to do a, like at least a bottle of this a day at least I try to get my water up my water intake up as much as I, as much as possible I need y'all to comment down below right now right now have you had water today have you had water today let me finish getting my gas and we're gonna go ahead and go to the store Phew. Okay, so got my exchanges done. My returns are complete. So now. So I want to get something to eat now or get something to eat later because I really need to get to the nail shop. We're making progress. Making progress. All right, I think I'm going to go ahead and go to the nail shop first. And then after that, then I'm going to go get me something to eat. That way I'll have time to think about what I want to eat. And I think I'm going to try something different again today. Exactly what, I don't know. But, whatever it is. I think I got a taste for some good old pasta. Like, I haven't had any pasta in a while. So, let me see wherever this, wherever the wind blows, that's where I'm going to go. <sighs> It's, uh, I've learned that it is so much better to do, to do your returns and to do your errands like in the middle of the week because everybody is out working and you don't have to deal with a big of a crowd. So this is perfect because I was able to go in and out all of the stores I needed to go in and out of to handle everything I needed to handle. And I didn't have to wait no long line. And I didn't have to worry about People being on top of me, me being on top of somebody else. It was just very seamless, and that is what I like. All right, so where is the nail shop at? Okay, so I need to go down here. All right, so I'll call y'all back when I get to the nail shop. I'll call y'all back. Yeah, I'm talking to you. 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 Yeah, I'm tal
Nó là nó nói thì trả tiền người ta phải gọi bằng cảnh sát Nó nói tại nó không trả tiền người ta phải gọi bằng cảnh sát just saw the clip of me of my nails but I just got the plain white tips today nothing too fancy just want to get a little yeah you know, see that just did like a little classic a classic one too that's all let me do a little overlay all right so I am starving let me get my thumbnail. Hold on, y'all. All right. So, I got my little thumbnail out the way. But, y'all, did y'all see the drama? Oh, my God. I have never witnessed anything like that before in my life. So, I'm assuming that the young lady who got her nails done was unhappy with the services that she got. So, her services came up to, like, $25. Um, and she gave the girl $18 or whatever she was like, but I'm still not satisfied with her services. So she proceeds to leave, proceeds to leave out. Well, obviously the owner goes to lock the door. Bad idea. You never hold anybody else against their will. You can't lock anybody in a facility. I don't care if they owe you anything. You cannot. That's, that's called kidnapping. So she messed up by locking the door, holding the girl hostage because she refused to pay her all that she was owed, that she was due. Um, and so the young lady called her boyfriend and, you know, they was woo-de-woo-de-woo-de-woo. -de -woo -de -woo -de -woo. 
I'm like, oh my gosh, the ghetto, the ghetto. And so the young Lynn who was doing my nails and she was stopping and she was shaking. I'm like, girl, calm down. Like, calm down. Focus on my nails. Like, we ain't got nothing to do with going on over there. It's the real deal. Help me. Help me. Nigga. Focus on my nails. She was like, I nervous. I scared. I'm like, I was like, you want to take a minute? So she stopped for a second. Did whatever she did, her little one, two, whatever. She came back and she was fine. I was like, what we got, what they got going on, ain't got nothing to do with me and you. You focus on my nails, okay? Because I'm paying you for my service and I need you to come through, for, okay? Because I ain't trying to be in here all day. <laughs> but honey, the ghetto in the nail shop, I have seen it all. And the girl was like, y'all, well, y'all heard, y'all heard part of the clip. I didn't want to have like the camera like all up or whatever and draw attention to the camera, what, but. Y'all basically heard what the girl was saying. She was like, you holding me hostage and you can't hold me hostage. I feel threatened. I feel threatened. Um, or whatever. So I'm like, oh, honey, the ghetto. The ghetto. Let me go ahead and pull, get some footage of this. <laughs> anyway, I am so starving. I am so starving. Like, my stomach is about to hit my back. So let me go find me something to eat. I still got a few more errands to run. So let's go get us something to eat. And then I call y'all back.
right, so we're at our last stop for today, and we are at the Publix. Um, I love coming to this Publix simply because of it's nicer, it's cleaner. They always have the um, buy one, get one free deals type things going on. So, and I came here to get my New Year's, um, New Year's dinner because I did not cook like a big dinner or didn't cook like a big meal for Christmas. And so, I kind of really want to get down and dirty in the kitchen for New Year's. Start the New Year's 2022, 2022 with a bang. So that's what we're going in the Publix to get a little grocery. And yeah, guys, so let's go. Let's do this. And another reason why I like this Publix is because it makes me feel um, kind of bougie. Bougie. never seen these black eyed peas packaged like this before that's cute look how they got these packaged like in this little vacuum sealed thing so i'm gonna get a small thing of this because everybody in my family hardly nobody eats them but i still like to have them cooked so i'm gonna get a thing of black eyed peas smoke pops go ahead and get a pack of that i mean this is like a one-stop shop right here and they got the collard, fresh collard greens. Well, not fresh, but a bag of collard greens. Get a bag of that. I mean, this is all you really need right here. This is this is it. Other than a little bit of fried chicken, this is the meal right here. Another thing I noticed is that they got this buy one, get one free. So if you buy one bag, you get the second bag for free. And if you get the one bag, you get that, get it for half that price. So. I have learned to take advantage of their buy one get one free here at Publix and I love it. All right, so these are the cakes and the pies over here. Do I need a chocolate cake? I really don't need no chocolate cake, but it's calling my name, call my name, and I'm gonna get it. All right, and just like that, we are done, y'all. Let's get on our little back to the his house to the his house to the his house to the his house thank you
right, guys. So I am back home. I hope you guys have enjoyed spending the day with me, hanging out with me. Um, I'm trying to figure out, do y'all want to see what I bought from Publix? I mean, it's like really, really small. Just a few items that I stopped at Publix. And then after I left Publix, I did go to Food Lion to get a few other things. But whenever people vlog or whatever, and they're like out about or whatever, and they do, they go shopping. Do y'all like seeing like what they bought all the time? I know me personally, I like seeing what people buy, especially when they go like do grocery store, go go to the grocery store or what's on sale, because I like to know if it's something that I could benefit from. And if it's something that I really like or my family likes, I want to see what's on sale and I like to know what people got. I'm just kind of nosy like that. But y'all comment down below and let me know if y'all like to see uh, grocery hauls. And um, so I'm trying to debate if I want to show you guys what I got. I mean, you guys really basically saw everything that I purchased anyway. But let me go ahead and just show you guys real quick because it's really, really a small amount of stuff. And I'm going to just show you guys real quick. So from Costco, I got these croissants right here. Uh, this bread, I got this from Publix. You guys saw me. Well, I don't know if you guys did see me, but I got two cocktails. I love these. I got an apple pie. This is for our New Year's Day dinner. I did get a thing of cornbread right here. I got some dinner yeast rolls. I'll be cooking that for dinner tonight. I purchased the ginger ale and lemonade. This came from Publix. And then this is a new brand of Canada Dry too that I've never seen before. And it's the blackberry ginger ale. See, I'm putting y'all on the stuff. If y'all had, if I hadn't have gone to Publix and showed you guys, y'all probably wouldn't have never known that Canada Dry has a new flavor and it's called blackberry ginger ale. Thank me later. So I got two of those. I ended up picking up the yellow rice. Y'all saw when I got the fat girl cake. Okay, so as soon as I get done with this video i'm going upstairs to eat my cake i'm going to be fat and i'm just going to chill okay got some black eyed peas i purchased two of these uh buy one get one free collard bags of collard greens that's going to be for my new year's dinner i also purchased these blueberry toaster tops so i guess you just put these in like the toaster or my like the air fryer and just warm them up and eat them like that uh, up, uh, also got the pork smoke hocks to put in my collard greens and then I got a thing of orange juice I did not get this ketchup I don't know why that's there that's kids probably had that earlier I did pick a thing up of cookies from Costco um, another thing of yeast rolls and then I also purchased two more things of orange so juice. yeah guys so i'm about to put up my little bit of grocery about to start my dinner for this afternoon i hope you guys have enjoyed today's video i'm not sure exactly how long this video is going to be but remember you guys to always keep looking good regardless of what you're going through remember that it's always somebody else out there that's going through a little bit worse than you remember to keep smelling good Nobody got to know what's in your bank account for you to smell good and look good, okay? Never, ever, 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 ever let anybody to dictate your mood. You have full control over your mood. You have full control over your destiny. And you can have anything that you want, anything that your little hearts desire. The only thing, you have to, only thing that you got to do is make it up in your mind. Put in a little bit of action work. Allow God to do what he going to do. Have faith and it will come to pass okay you guys i love y'all so much make sure you like comment and subscribe and i think this will probably be the last video for 2021 and i will see you guys on my next video love y'all bye